All right, so uh, I understand most people don't get that reference <laughs> because most people aren't into music that their dads are into. But <laughs> all right, so it looks like this is uh, Ned and Bo Scotty going up against these two. I was wondering who Ned teamed with. Yeah, I remember they talking about it earlier. Uh, I know they've seen before. And I believe the last time they teamed, they won at some some tournament. I forget which one it was. It wasn't a Midwest Mayhem, but it was like it was like a smaller tournament. All right, we're going traffic safety Fox and Falco <laughs> versus uh, Ned's Cloud Post Peach. Mm -hmm. I really, as Fox, love the Peach matchup. Mm -hmm. I think it's pretty garbage for Peach. Um, Cloud, on the other hand, is close to even. I might give it a, a slight advantage to Cloud. And Falco, I'm just going to assume Falco loses every character here. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I'm just going to assume Falco loses every matchup on this stage right now. <laughs> Could be wrong about Peach, but you never know. Yeah. So, uh, it's like they're thinking about Lilac. Uh, which is surprising. I feel like Fox and Falco don't really like Lilac that much, ironically. It's true. Most Fox and Falcos don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, for these characters, that is. Yeah. Um, Oh, okay. they were going for the the taunt, the the yeah. what do you call it, the intercom thing. I'm surprised there wasn't a Smashville. I know Fox doesn't like Smashville, but Falco kills primarily off the side. Yeah. Back here. For two spaces, I'm really surprised to see this stage. Game yeah, that's one. What I was saying. yeah, I'm pretty surprised they struck here, but so far, uh, looks him a little bit of the lead. Ned doing a good job, not gonna hit too much. 25 percent on him. He just of the. Uh, Falco likes to go for Dare off stage because Falco's got some good off stage game. Yeah. But I don't think he'll be able to get that on uh, on the umbrella. Yeah, I don't think so. Maybe on Cloud, I can see that. Cloud doesn't snap to the ledge. A lot of neutral air. Almost taking the stock. I'm actually surprised it didn't. You see, this is really good for Bo here because, again, up B or uh, spacey side Bs will sometimes just miss the ledge. Yeah. Bo could just float there with, uh, like, melee, float there with a Nair or a Fair. Yeah, especially on Lila, because, like, that, that's why one of the reasons, like, it's, it's, sometimes the stage does not help you out at all. It's recovery. Yeah, I, again, I don't know why they picked this stage. <laughs> Maybe it was literally just to get the, uh, the taunt, and then in, Bo didn't even let him do it. That so. might have been it, yeah. <laughs> Bo being rude, going in for a dash attack when he's trying to do us all a favor. Alright, so... Lily, only 130%, but that back throw is going to take a stock right there. Yeah, Peach's back throw, pretty good. Yeah, Dare to Dream, almost almost at uh, kill percent, too. Oh, he's Fox, this is kill percent. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Anything from Cloud will kill him. Maybe not a full stage bear, but anything else. God, like a mid stage there. dare. Man, like. Every time I see down there just kill when it's not the spike, I kind of get upset. Ooh, another like, one. That I'm okay with, because that was a spike. That was spike. But like just dying from the sour spot, that, that triggers me. That make, yeah, I, I'm not going to lie, it makes me upset too. Why should a lingering hitbox... <laughs> well, that's not the, the late, that's like the, there's three dare yeah, hitboxes. Yeah. That's the middle one. But still, I don't like it. All right, but Ned at 120% right now, uh, doing a good job living. Does he have I a jump? He does a jump, yeah. Yeah, Ned's good at saving his jump. Wow, that forest match just hit everybody. Fox's forward smash is, he's got stupid active frames. Yeah. It might have helped uh, a little bit. Quilly uh, being there might have helped, but. Wow, oh, is he dead? No, he saved him with the Firebird. <laughs> oh, the up smash, taking the first stock. I mean, taking the second stock on both. So, uh, one stock away. Red Team not doing too bad, but they're getting pretty close to kill percents. Ooh, wow. I didn't know Cloud's back throw was that low. That was also a Lilat assist too. It was kind of angled. Yeah. Had the stage been straight, that would not have connected. It seems like something they probably laughed though too. So I don't know. Maybe maybe it does work usually. Maybe not the sweet spot of Peach up smash though. That, that was like the very tip of it. So of the two characters to be in a two v one, I think Fox might be the better one just to be a little faster. But they're not gonna get that option here. Uh oh. They're open up here. Not gonna miss it. Yeah, at this point, like, yeah, he's probably thinking about game two. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Looks like he DI'd straight in. If you DI straight in, you usually die on the top. Yeah. Sometimes it's a DI mixed up, really, because DIing out, you might have risked dying from the side. Mm -hmm. So the, uh, the Fox Falco team not working out. 
But you did say these guys are uh, running a couple different teams, so I might see a switch. I don't think it was the team. I honestly do think it was the stage. Yeah. I think the stage hindered them a lot. That probably helped. But yeah, look at like. <laughs> Alright, going straight to Bowser. Yeah. I was thinking like most of the times people don't even think that way. Like, okay, I must be reason wrong character. So. Ned switch. doesn't like fighting heavies. Yeah. I don't think anybody likes fighting heavies. I do, but I, I like fighting story. heavies. <laughs> Other than Bowser, I will fight any heavy any day. <laughs> but uh. Town City, yeah, it's definitely a good stage for for red team. Obviously, Bowser has kill confirms. I don't know how how often Bowser's gonna get kill confirms in doubles, but Fox's F throw will combo into Bowser's up smash. Yeah, easy. That's true. They could do that. Probably half stage will be fine. Bowser's hitbox just so big, and F throw has a fairly low angle. Yeah. All right, so Bowser we'll ha no, no. Bowser Harbor will get comboed hard. All right, definitely. These two characters probably gonna eat him up, man. <laughs> Bowser on the stage. I'm surprised Ned didn't try to go for a follow-up there. I feel like he could have went out there, but he probably didn't want to risk it. He wanted to go help his teammate. That was a great up smash. Count out the uh, the, hand, uh, the aerial from Ned. Now it's interesting seeing this because Ned is often called one of the the best clouds in the world. He's definitely in that top five, I think. Yeah. For sure. But we're not seeing as much as many as many big combos as the previous set, which also included a cloud. Yeah. Ned he doesn't go for too many of the uh, the limit confirms. Like, I've seen him play dubs a lot. And I don't know. This looks a lot more like sound neutral in one v ones than it does yeah. teamwork. Which a lot of people say teamwork always wins. Which teamwork is definitely <laughs> beneficial. Yeah. But you can be a great team fighting people who are just really good at one v ones be a toss-up really yeah and that's what we're seeing here is they're just playing individually really well yeah it's not like super high level team play like you saw last time like you were saying but it's definitely a high level singles play yeah it's working though yeah look at this so the stage control uh blue team going pretty well and that nair almost killed at the top wow <laughs> oh not a huge punish but the, the, <laughs> The I've never seen hit, that kill. Match. I've seen it hit, but I've never seen it kill. Yeah, that's pretty funny, actually. And Red Team actually in the lead right now, so the Bowser thing might be uh, the difference. The Bowser is a monster. Heavies in general. Uh oh, is he dead? They're so good in doubles. Both in the footstool. I don't know how on purpose that was, but <laughs> it's gonna work out. But yeah, Bowser I think is one of the best heavies in doubles. Yeah, I think he might be the best because he's got speed and mobility. Yeah, and he has the, those, those smash attacks like. His forward smash and up smash, like that's just so good. Though. You can just throw it out randomly and you might hit somebody. His, yeah, his hitboxes are so big too, it's easy to combo. At the same time, he's so big, he's easy to combo. And doubles. Yeah. But with the teammate, you can definitely help that out a little bit. And man, going for the <laughs> down beat. <laughs> that's type of stuff, man. Like, if they weren't ready, that could have that ended badly. With that Fox stock, uh, Blue Team is going to reclaim the lead. Yeah. And Quilly at 76%, uh, pretty close to kill percent. But Bo is too, honestly. Well, both the blue team is. So this could go pretty south. Peach is pretty light, so. Uh oh, is this kill percent? Oh, I think Dare Dream messed it up. I think he might have got the kill for him. Probably would have killed him there. Yeah. That's the one bad thing. Like, you see, like, Bowser or Dunk Dunk 18. Like, sometimes you have to just let them do their, uh, their, their uh, kill for him. I mean, Fox is. Oh, are we. What's, oh, wow. We got. We got it. Okay, this happened. Yeah. Yeah, Fox is up there is good. I don't think it's as powerful as Bowser's up here, though. Definitely not. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and now Ned with the 2v1. Wow, definitely one of the best characters at a 2v1. And the uh, crowd for obvious reasons. is getting hyped for individual Fox up airs. <laughs> I think they're going <laughs> for a different set. Oh, are they? Yeah. Oh, okay. I got paid attention more. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Ned not doing a bad job. He hasn't got too many hits, but he's not dead yet, so that's good. Yeah, if he can't snap that ledge, that's that's a kill from Bowser. Yeah, that that uh, team combo not too clean right there. Not getting too much off of it. I'm expecting a footstool because a lot of Bowsers will up throw yeah. into footstool up smash, but it doesn't look like we're getting it. Oh, back, back air, air trying to clear up the stock. Yeah, that was clean. Not not too happy about that. Uh, that team, second game too. Yeah, that was definitely an improvement. Bowser definitely helped. Yeah. I also think not being on Lilat for spaces <laughs> helped a lot. <laughs> yeah. So there was a. Uh, Two plus two equals four there. Yeah. So, 
Uh, this this would be a pretty big upset, I feel like, if uh, a blue team won. I mean, yeah, red team won. Sorry. You see Battlefield. I don't know what the seeds were for these guys. It's like they're thinking about something. I don't know. If both Cares? Which? He's going back to Falco. Oh, no. Okay. Going back to Falco. That's interesting. I don't know anything about Bowser and Battlefield. I know a lot of Falcos like Battlefield. Mm -hmm. Most Foxes do as well. Yeah, definitely. So that's fair. Uh, so he is going back to the Falco. Let's see if that this uh, switch is going to help out Red Team or it's going to hurt him. That Bowser was doing a lot of work. I wouldn't want to leave... Uh, Bear's already at 45. I feel yeah, like he kind of is going to smack on the side. <laughs> I feel like Quilly needs to be over there like right away. Just because Cloud Fox, Fox is so... He falls so fast, he just gets bopped right away yeah, in the early thing, percents. The thing about... Uh, Battlefield isn't exactly a bigger stage than Town of City, but it seems like so far that uh, red team, blue team's having their way like on separate sides, doing the 1v1 game. And again, Fox lost stage, he's able to recover though. Yeah, but 158%, not too far off from getting the kill. Kicking on Quilly for a little bit, Dare rushes in and they mix him up, go for Dare. Wow, that was a good uh, option coverage right there. Poke up the lower cover and then uh, Ned just punched him when he landed on stage above me. Oh my god. <laughs> <Jeez, that's very laughs> Fox. That's that's what happens to Fox. Yeah, Ned so far, he's been oh, oh. that down there. Taking the stock. Ned again, every game I think Ned is one of the last person to lose his first stock. Ned's good at that. Oh, so far. Uh, Whoa, the okay. umbrella. What percent was Quilly at there? He was at like 130. Yeah. Okay, okay. That's pretty high. That's fair enough. That's fair. All right, so. Dare to Dream at a pretty high percent. But Ned's still on his first stock, though, at 116%. We'll see how long he can hold his stock. This will definitely be important. If he can uh, take Dare to Dream's second stock, this will look super good for Blue Team. He's going to have to use their limit there to the offstage there. Cloud's there, it's good. <laughs> yeah, man. That's uh, that's something every Fox has to deal with. They go for an up air, boom, dare. Yeah, that's some really good coverage right there from Bo. Uh, Quilly was kind of hanging out on the side, and then Bo just helped out his teammate. That just recovered to the ledge. They finally get off that net stock. Bo at 81, but still, I feel like Blue Team does have a really good lead. Yeah. Oh. So yeah, Blue Team looking like looking like a better team than last game, honestly. Like they're, they're following up more, they're covering each other. This is like uh, some really good like dub fundamentals. I don't know a lot about Falco and doubles, but I know as soon as Bowser is on the field in doubles, people start sweating. Yeah. And I feel like that was oh, definitely wow. a factor. Oh, you got the tech? Yeah. The tech right there from uh, Willie. Forward tilt gonna kill off the side. We have a 2v1 there with three stocks to yeah. take. Not looking too good. For, uh, and every character here is fair foot stoolable. <laughs> yeah, sure. How many characters aren't fair foot stoolable? Oh, I think all of them are. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, Villager will survive unless you're on Smashville. But if you have a good recovery and you have to jump, you'll survive. Wow, that was a great angle right there from uh, Dead of Dream. But it's, once again, man, it's not looking great for him. Okay, I don't know what bows do. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay, and up throw to finishing touch. The signature cloud combo. Yeah. Finishing touch. Taking it. Blue team looking good. Looking really good that third game. I don't know. The Bowser switching off. I don't know. That might have not been the greatest pick. They didn't do terrible, but. I don't know a lot about like Falco and doubles, but I'm just going to assume that Bowser's better in doubles. Yeah. Could be wrong. I don't play either character. Maybe he just felt more comfortable with the Falco, so you know. Battlefield 2. It might have been a Bowser thing. Bowser might not like that stage. I can see that. Not going to kill us early from the, uh, from the top. But, yeah, uh, Town was probably pivotal in that set, too. Yeah, definitely. Not the fact that they were just not on Lilat, but the blast zones there, as well as the 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 stage itself, it's bigger ground-wise, so Fox yeah. can escape whenever he needed to. And the thing is, too, like Bowser lives longer on Battlefield, 